State lost eight players through ejection as a result of the fight. They played most of the second half with only four players on the floor and the last 25 seconds with only two. Now, that's a big power play to overcome, five against two. Eddie Bird, Larry's brother, was one of those ejected. The fight took place early in the second half, and it was wild. Nice move. He hit that shot earlier. Sasha tied up. And now, Darren Lyle wants the, goes right after Radunovic. This is outrageous. The Indiana State players coming off the bench, and the fight is still well underway. And it is really getting out of control. That's where the jump ball is going. Well, you check out number 52, Indiana State's Daryl Lyles. He reaches across. He grabs Sasha Radunovic and started punching his face. All of a sudden, everyone there, including the entire Sycamore bench, they all got thrown out. The referee Jim Bain needed help from the TV replays to sort it out for himself. And I want to see if he throws a fist at 52. Indiana State team left the court. Only four guys came back eligible to play, and those four cut a 15-point lead down to four. Then two guys fouled out. They're playing five on two. He'll take it to the hole. Oh, great right pass. Pass to Townsend Harris, who got it off the glass. <laughs> what a power play. They score five on two. Didn't last long, though. Wichita State won 84-69 in a bizarre game. They were just glad to get out of town at the end of the